For this test, uh, it's a very straightforward one. Uh, we're just doing it's a, it's, a, it's a very quick video. We're at 12 volts here. We've got the um, got the Zico Drive ZD10 LCD here, and then we've got the ZD uh, N23126 stepper motor. Uh, we're just looking at the the impact here of um, different settings and that, how it impacts on the maximum speed that we can get. So we've got the phase current set here at 2.34 amp. Uh, as I say, we're at 12 volt. So we got, we're at 300 RPM, we press start, and we can see, no problem, it's running. Um, it gets, it's perfectly capable of angling that. So if we stop that, go back, we'll go up to 400 RPM. We can see what that, what that does. Uh, there we go. Again, you can see it's starting up, absolutely no problem. Uh, there's no, obviously there's no load on this, which is having an impact, but See if I start to grip it as hard as I can. It's still, it's still handling it, no problem. If we go up to 500, just bear with me. 500. There we go. Again, it's going up there, but you can see now as I as I grab it, it's um, it doesn't like it. It can start up again, but there's no, there's no torque there at all on these settings. Again, we start starting up under no load. I'm touching, I'm touching, I'm touching, and just no, it's gone. Oops. Oh. Again, if we just go, let's try 600. I think we get the same thing, but we can have a quick look at 600. Now, this is an example. Uh, we, we, we've got a few articles about this, but this is a. You see, uh, you see there 600. It's starting, and it just it can't get there. It's stalling. Uh, get back to what I was saying. Sorry, this is an example of what we're talking about. Where with the stepper motor, um, with the stepper motor, you get as as your speed goes up, your torque um, is it, it really really drops off. And this is why, I suppose, if we just go back here, if we drop the speed back down, um, you can see in that in that sort of range. Once we once we've got above 500 on these particular settings, obviously there are other changes that we could make. But on this particular one, once we've gone above 500, we we've just got no torque at all. You know, you you, you touch the um, touch the shaft there, as it were, and um, there's it's, there's just nothing happening. Again, we're now at 300 again, and there's I'm just gripping that as tight as I can, and it's 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 going. Um, Say it again. Um, as I said, there are some changes we could make. We can try a quick one here. Uh, if we just go in the settings on this particular one, we can change the phase current a bit. We can put get a bit more power in there. Um, shouldn't you got, you've got to be careful doing this because if you if you depending how long you're running it for, you can you're going to end up with um, if if you put too much in, you're going to end up with um, some issues, um, mainly around heat and obviously long-term heat. You'll then get damage to the controller and also to the motor. Basically, um, let's try 500 again. See what happens here. So it's away there. You can see as I'm gripping it, there's a, it stalled it, but there's definitely more power there. Um, yeah, it's 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 not what we want, but there's definitely more power there. If we went up, if we tried to go up, see if we can see what it see what it starts at. Oops. Starts at 600 now. Um, this controller is on a. You might be wondering why you why it's, you see milliliters coming up. But um, this is on pump mode. You see there now it's 600. It's it's starting. Uh, there won't be much torque there again, but but it is getting going. Um, if I use this button now, we can increase the speed a bit more. Uh, it's not it's not having it now. Um, so it's 660 there. Push it up to some bit of and see, see what happens there. Um, I mean, this this video is obviously not scientific in the slightest, uh, to be quite honest. But it's it's just there to try and give you. It's something that we get asked quite a lot. Again, you can see there. If you if you can see the motor shaft not spinning. But if we pull this back down again, 600, 
giving it that bit of extra current has helped um, up in the voltage would help if you if you do need to get the speed up um, 700 don't like it um, there, there are other things you can look at I mean the inductance of the motors is, a, is, a, is, a, is, a, is another factor it's essentially fairly straightforward it's about being able to it's the, being able to get the power into the coils in time obviously the faster you go the less time you've got to get that power in there to keep the torque up um, I hope this is uh, I hope this is of, of interest as an intro video but if you've got any questions just have a look at zcardrive.com you can ask us any questions you like um, related to motor control obviously um, and we're, we're always happy to, to try and help thanks for watching